There's so many vegan RVers out there. I thought I was gonna change it up a little bit more. So I've been reading into this carnivore diet recently. We'll stop there. I know I've only been here for like a day and my house is already dirty. I'm gonna go to the supermarket, we're gonna get some meat, because that's all I'm gonna be eating for the next at least 30 days, and then, um, hello Amelia, how are you doing? We're gonna say hi to Amelia real quick. Hello Amelia. Maybe go to H&M to get some cold weather gear, because I wasn't really prepared to be in cold weather, so I figure now's as good time as ever to go grab some cold weather gear. I love H&M, it's like my favorite store, my favorite like retail store ever, so I'm really just excited to go there, because there's an outlet right across the street. All right, now I'm in, on my way into H&M. I actually brought my big camera, it's in my truck. Sadly, I forgot my battery and memory card, so I'll be recording H&M with my phone. And sadly, I have not gotten my Google Pixel 2 yet, so this is, this is what we've got. But there's a sale at H&M, and I'm scared to go in because I might have to uh, buy everything. We down by the river all through the night Watching the stars and the city lights Right from the start said we never grow apart till we chit Such a sight, watching all the lovers fall into the night. All the moods in a heartbeat. Yes, you guys heard me correctly. I'm going to go full carnivore for the next 30 days. Is that 30 for you? I think so. 30 days. With the goal of reaching 90 days total at least but i'm going to start with 30 days so that uh i can just get a feel for it make sure i'm you know not feeling deathly ill or anything like that but my goal is to reach 90 days and see how i feel see how i like the diet because i feel like 90 days is a good test to really see how your body's adjusting to a diet so this got started the same way pretty much everything gets started in my life and that's from listening to a podcast while i drive uh, I was listening to the Joe Rogan experience and there was this guy, Dr. Sean Baker on there, who's a full carnivore and he's been a carnivore for a full year now. So he's extremely, Amelia go away. <laughs> so he's over 50 years old. He just broke a couple world records, I believe, like in rowing or something of the sort. But he's basically, he's super fit. He seems super healthy. He says he feels amazing. He's found profound health benefits from it. So I thought, why not give it a try? I love testing diets and testing things out on my body and seeing how my body reacts. I've done keto for eight months. I've done a, a whole ton of different diets. I used to weightlift a lot. I used to be much more into weightlifting and I kind of want to get back there. I want to get stronger again. I want to get more toned up again like I used to be. So I'm going to probably gear towards th that way rather than the endurance thing. It's hard for me because I don't have a gym on the road. So anyway, that's how I got started. Amelia, stop being so loud. Thank you. Yes, so as with any diet, as with any giant change in health, you should always um, track yourself and you know, know, know what's happening to your body and just be aware that you're going to something completely new and that specific diet, it might not work for you. So I'm always cognizant of that and that's why I'm gonna start with 30 days, see how I feel after that, and then I'm going to ramp up to 90 if I feel, if I'm feeling really good, I'm gonna go up to 90 days and see where I stand at that point. So I started this today. I'm going to be making a trip to Costco probably tomorrow because I realized that that's going to be the cheapest way to do this because they have great prices on bulk meat. But I'm going to be eating everything from steak to chicken to pork. Um, and then I think I'm even going to eat dairy and eggs. And that's going to be it though. Nothing, nothing else, just animal meat, dairy, and eggs. It's definitely different. I know, every, I know there's so many RVers who are like, super probably against this and there's a ton of vegan RVers and stuff like that but 
I'm not a normal RVer. I like to do things a little differently and I like to test my body and I'm not against meat in any facet. I, I'm completely for hunting, I'm completely for fishing, I'm completely for farming. What I'm gonna be doing is every Sunday, since I started today and it's Sunday, um, every Sunday I'm going to be documenting my skin, how I feel in general, performance increases. I'm gonna really narrow that down over this next week. I'm really excited about it. I don't know how you guys feel about it. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing for the next 30 days. I'm gonna be writing it all down, but I was thinking about documenting it on these videos too. So I was thinking about on Sunday, just giving you guys a little update on how I feel, how everything's going, what's going on, how my diet's been, how, how I'm able to hold down food and how much food I'm able to hold down. If you're interested in, at all in that, let me know. Um, Cause if nobody's interested in it, I'll just exclude it from the videos. It's really no big deal. It's just something for my personal curiosity. It's not really necessarily for these videos or anything like that, but I like to share what's going on in my life with you guys. So I thought I'd share this with you and if you guys have an interest in it, I'd keep sharing. But yeah, uh, this is my first day at this campground. It's been a great day. I got some I got some pretty good rest. I woke up pretty early and I went to bed really late, but I got some pretty good rest this morning. It rained, but it stopped and I went out and I exercised and then I went to the store and I went to the outlets and I got some clothes. Uh, I need to buy more clothes though. And yeah, just, it's been a wonderful day. I'm really excited about this campground. I'm probably not gonna be like venturing out into Memphis for a couple days. So I'll probably be doing more like at home videos talking about, I have a huge list of things that I wanna talk about that I've been thinking about while I've been traveling. So I'm super excited about this. I'm super excited to be in a stationary spot again. I love like when I just start somewhere for a month and I'm like, I. 30 days here. I'm just, it makes me so happy. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And make sure to comment below. Let me know what you think about this. If you hate it, let me know. Especially if you have a valid opinion on it and not just some hate message. I would love to hear a valid opinion. I'm, I'm completely open to any opinions. I'd love to hear what you think about it and if you think it's healthy, unhealthy, one way or the other, or just just your opinion. And go check out uh, this guy. His name's Dr. Sean Baker. Go check him out. See what you think about him. Yeah, let me know. Till next time, guys. See you later.